It's a mini envelope containing mini figures. Apparently that's not even... And a rather shiny envelope it is. Look at the neat envelope here. This is from the folks, this comes to us from the folks over at Mini Figs Monthly. Every single month, Mini Figs Monthly sends you a collection of mini figures. That would explain the small, thin nature of the envelope, but there are mini figures. I can feel them. They're right there. There's one, there's two, there's three, and more. Probably about four or five of them inside. I want to know even where they got this envelope from. Unless somebody has taken the time to travel to the future and get these neat looking chromium envelopes. But I'll put the link down below so if you guys are interested and want to subscribe to Mini Figs Monthly, all the information and linkage will be down below. Let's go ahead and get this opened up. I got my trusty knife, Old Red, here. I want to make sure that I'm not cutting anything that could be potentially... Can I rip this open? Oh, well, maybe I can rip it open. Sorry, Red, I got your hopes up. Huh? horrible thing to do. Bring somebody in to help out with the team and then when they get there, sorry we don't need you. Yeah, go sit the bench. Gonna go ahead and open this up. Doing it the old-fashioned way with my bare hands. What do we got here? We have a five dollar off coupon code. Use the code the review spotters on your first minifigs monthly order. Website is www.cratejoy.com forward slash subscription dash box forward slash minifigs dash monthly. You can also follow them over on Instagram at minifigs underscore monthly. How about that? So if you guys would like to subscribe and get minifigs delivered to your your house, you can use the $5 off coupon code, the review spotters. I'm taking a pause just so that somebody could write that down. Got it? Yes? Okay, you got it? Okay, put that to the side. So let's see what we got for minifigures. We also got a little card here. Your minifigures have arrived from Minifigs Monthly. Whether you are a Lego fanatic, casual fan, or AFOL, that would be adult fan of Lego, we hope you enjoy this month's minifig pack. Joy awaits. Check us out on social media. You can also contact them. There's their email and their website. Okay, so let's see what we got. See what we got. See what we got. I'm going to dump out all the contents. It's just a lot easier that way. Everything else, anything else in there? It kind of looks like the opener to Doctor Who or that really long video, that long part of Star Trek, the motion picture where they're traveling through all that fog and they get to V'ger. V'ger. There's a sticker, Minifigs Monthly. I can add that to my sticker collection. See, it's a sticker. <laughs> no, I didn't make it up. No, it's a sticker, see? Eh? Don't believe me? Yeah, see, sticker. Add that to my sticker collection. Okay, so let's see what we got here. We got minifigure one, minifig type, Lord Vampire theme, the monster fighters, accessory, the great sword. Ah, that's pretty cool. Now, I remember picking up some of the minifigs, the Monster Hunter minifigs. I, don't, I can't remember whether I picked up this one or not. Comes with a little sword. I say a little sword. Look how broad that sword is. It's about, it's almost, let's see here. It's almost his length. I guess that's right. Most swords are generally quite long. I like his face. Does he have a back? Does he have the other printing on the back there? He does. There's that side, and then there's this side. Kind of digging this side. He's got printing on the front. He's got printing on the back. He's got printing all over. And this one was called Lord Vampire. Lord Vampire. You have to somehow say it with an accent. Uh, minifig 2 is Anne Lee. Theme, Monster Fighters. I see a, tr a pattern forming. Accessory is the crossbow. I do think I, do I got this one. And I did a whole bunch of these during the... Uh, I think it was Spooky Spots. I did these several years ago. Get her dumped out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Does she have two? She has two different faces. There's this one, and then there's this one. Kind of like the little bit of a smirk, so I'm going to move this head around. There we go. Put the hair back on. And we will give her her weapon, which is her crossbow. There we go. Uh, the 
the uh, the little arrow here doesn't fit in there, but we can just put it into our hand. There we go. And once again, a neat looking figure. Lord Vampire, meet Anne Lee. Hello, hi, nice to meet you. Okay, put those right there. Uh, minifigure three, we got minifig type mummy theme monster fighters accessory ancient sword. Now, even if I already had the mummy, I am down for extra mummies. You can never have enough mummies. This one comes with a substantial sword. It also looks like you could attach something to the end of it, like a chain. I'll just put that into its hand. It obviously doesn't have any printing on the back, as you would see it. Nice looking face, though. Mummy, have you you've met you've met oh you've met the others? Okay. Oh, you met them coming into the in, into the review room. Okay. There you go. And then the last one we got. This one is minifig four, minifig type Dr. Rodney Rathbone. I would love to legally change my name to that. That would be Rath Rathbone. Lord Rathbone. How about that? Theme, Monster Fighters, once again. And the accessory in this case is a foil and revolver. The foil being the sword, revolver being the gun. Looks like he also has himself a balder cap. Balder hat. There we go. Put that to the side. Does this one have two different prints? Turn it around. No, it does not. Look at the mutton chops, though, happening on the side of this minifigure's head, though. We'll put the sword, excuse me, the foil, into his hand. I say that, I feel like I'm talking about aluminum foil. Like, he should just have this little roll of foil. You need foil? No? You. Foil. Who's cooking up fish? I got, I got your foil. And there's a little revolver. Back print. Oh, does he have a robotic leg? He does have a robotic leg. Would you have robotic legs back in the day? I guess it would be like a steampunk makeshift leg he's got there. That's pretty cool. I like the revolver. Sword in the other hand. And of course he's got the balder cap, balder hat. That's a stylish outfit. I would love this outfit. Of course, I would like two functioning legs, but it's a neat looking figure. Definitely had ourselves a theme happening here. We got four minifigures. Let's see if I can actually grab all four of these. There's one. There's two. There's three. I'm not quite. Don't choke, don't choke, don't choke. And there's the fourth one. All monster slash monster hunter related. Monster hunter related. I'd say my favorite is probably Rodney Rathbone. I even just like saying it. Feel a little biased for saying that, but so we got more minifigures that I can add to my collection, and that comes to us from the folks. Let me just get them all standing here. Coming to us from once again the folks over at Minifigs, Minifigs Monthly. Once again, the website you can head over to CrateJoy.com forward slash subscription box forward slash Minifigs Monthly. You can also get yourself five dollars, five dollars off using the coupon code the review spotters. Today we were having a look at the very first mini figs monthly. And we got four mini figures in the process. If you guys haven't had a chance to hit that little subscribe button down below, what exactly are you waiting for? Monsters to be knocking on your door? They're probably all getting together for a meeting. You're probably gonna have to make sure you've got enough egg salad sandwiches on hand. And let me just also give this little bit of advice, this tidbit of advice for you. Miracle Whip is the way to go. I don't care what anyone will tell you. Uh, mayonnaise, no, no, no. Mayonnaise is bland. I dismiss those that like mayonnaise. Miracle Whip is the way to go. Let me know down below. Miracle Whip, mayonnaise, let the great debate begin. But more videos, guys, will be coming your way as always. I'm sorry I ended this video with a, a fight among viewers. Miracle Whip, just FYI, is the better, better thing. So, as always, guys, thanks for watching, as you always do, and I'll see you next time.